Hey everybody, it's Mr. Game Show with your play break for Thursday, April 2nd, 2020. Today's game, top of the charts. With today's special guest host, the host of American Top 40, please welcome Shadow Stevens. Thanks, Chris. Great to be here. Let's play. In this edition, we're looking back at some of the UK's finest music and challenging you to name which hits top the American charts. Number four. Phil Collins reached the charts in 1985 with which iconic song? Was it Against All Odds, One More Night, or Susudio? The song that hit the top of the chart in July 1985 was... Susudio. Although the song only lasted one week on the U.S. pop charts, it still remains one of his most recognizable hits. Number three. Elton John has had many hits throughout his career, but which of these became number one late in 1972? Daniel, Crocodile Rock, or Rocket Man? What do you think? Daniel followed close behind in the number two spot, but the song that reached number one, that was Crocodile Rock. Number two. Which record by the Beatles actually replaced their own number one hit, I Want to Hold Your Hand? Was it I Get Around, She Loves You, or Twist and Shout? Answer, please. On February 1st, 1964, the Billboard Hot 100 found that the Beatles replaced their own number one song with She Loves You. Number one. The Spice Girls peaked at the top of the charts once in February 1997. Which song earned them that spot? Wannabe, Spice Up Your Life, or Stop? Do you know it? Shortly after Valentine's Day, the girls' catchphrase, Zigga Zigga, caught on as their song, Wannabe, peaked and remained on the charts for 23 weeks. Ooh. I'm your friend of the void, Shadow Stevens, and remember, if the world is your oyster and you can't find your pearl, you can always have lunch. Ooh, that reminds me, I need to make lunch. Thanks, Shadow. So how did you do today? Let us know in the comments down below and be sure to join us every weekday for more fun and games right here on Playbreak.